as I was saying, yeah. You know what, actually, yeah, let me set the pace, yeah, with this. Pick up Remain Relevant, you're done now. Remain Relevant TV here. Topic today is man in Enfield being jailed for 22 years for stabbing. Now, viewers, we're going to call this man Waste because of Waste of Space is what he is. Now, Waste of Space attacked his victim's friend a few hours before the actual victim who was stabbed up several times in the neck, chest, and stomach wow. had to be sent to a special trauma unit. Wow. Now, viewers, the 22 years that Waste of Space got was IPP. So that means he have to do half his sentence first and then the parole board could already release him when they feel like he's good enough a good boy, basically, to be released. But we ain't never coming out. Now, viewers, I like your opinion. But, but I don't this believe one. that. I don't think that's Where how IPP goes. IPP, what? yeah, indeterminate public protection, yeah, bro, is a fucked up thing to get out of, mate. Yeah, my mate's been doing. My mate did nine off a of two. You got two IPP, end up doing nine. Yeah, okay. My next mate got sixteen years IPP, and I said, bruv, boy, bruv, you can't even piss wrong. Yeah, okay, to have twenty-two years IPP, fam. They're not letting him out any time, any time, any time at all soon, people. I May mean, I tell you that for now, for free. Why are these youths out there afraid to get a black eye or afraid to take a broken jaw? Because when they get to prison, all they've got is their fist. And if they can't fight with their fist views, they become victims automatically. Because Monday to Sunday, someone will be punching them up in the face, taking their goods off them, taking their tuna can, taking their noodles, taking their shower gel, taking their dove soap taking all the goods that they like and relish in prison. It was also said when Waste of Space home got searched, a meat cleaver was found in his room. Now, viewers, he said the meat cleaver, <laughs> the meat cleaver was used to scratch his back. Now, viewers, that's ironic because now he's gone prison, he's got plenty of hands to scratch his back for him. Viewers, the judge looked at Waste of Space and said Waste of Space don't need to be in society because Waste of Space does not want to be free. Now, Waste of Space is in prison and someone has to tell him when he can be free what he could do, when he could do it. Having face tax viewers knowing that you're going to be one day in front of a judge ain't going to help you. All it's going to do is prosecute you. Remain on the TV, like and subscribe. Peace. <laughs> yeah, bro, he's got a little way about himself. <laughs> he makes me laugh. It must be my friend Ratty, bro. Big up Ratty. Matthew, what's going on, bro? You're cool, cuz. Where you there? I ain't seen him for fucking years and years and years, bro. Yeah, Matthew Lindsay, what's going on, bro? You're good, fam. Yeah, big up, bro. Get me, fam. You know how we do, bro. Yeah, peace. Here we go now, yeah? So, let's go back to Kozo, yeah? Yes, Quincy to Kozo. Um, yeah, so, another day. Another story, I suppose. So, yeah, we're going to touch on a few things today. We're going to wrap them up in one. You get it? Yeah? And, to tell you the truth, yeah, Let's start with let's start let's start with just what happened. Let's just start with what happened, because because the reason I'm only gonna I don't know reason I'm speaking like this because everything's tied into everything that's going on. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, coincidences don't happen. Do you know what I mean? Right. So, right. what I'm saying is now basically. Ah, in fact, in fact, in fact, in fact, let's break it down like this. Yeah, we're gonna touch on the bouncer documentary. We're gonna touch on Conan, and we're gonna touch on Crept. And we're only going to touch on them because of what's been going on. You get what I'm saying? Really and truly, I wasn't even going to say nothing about the Bouncer documentary. Because for me, it's just a PR stunt. Do you know the ones there? That's about it. But there was a little red flag that I saw in there in regards to Conan that was very... Was very it wasn't very nice, actually. Do you know what I mean? Because obviously recently... You know, all these statements have been going around about Bouncer and Conan and rare, rare, rare. Like, at the end of the day, yeah, when people, when written statements come about, I don't really take no notice of them because I've seen people around me make, make, make witness statements about the ops. So I'm not really, I'm really not gonna, I'm not, no one can't show me a statement and say, oh yeah, that's a statement from my man, he's a snitch. They don't work like that for me, I've seen it in prison. My own, my own people around me making statements to say other people are snitches, and that's the ops. And if it's my, if it's my ops, come on, you know what I mean. But when you, when you see a fake statement, you know a fake statement. So statements I don't really get. I mean, but someone showed me something in regards to Conan that he obviously stood in the dock and gave evidence for something that unfortunately he witnessed and something happened to him and his family. And obviously, yeah, obviously I read the newspaper article. Obviously, so that is facts. Yeah. 
And I'm not, and then, yeah, let's, let's start like this. I'm not really saying that Conan, or anybody for that matter, yeah, should not, should not, should not talk to police. I'm not saying none of that. Because you know why I'm not saying that? Because I'm not going to be standing out here alone as a bad guy saying that he's a snitch, he's a snitch, he's right. a snitch, he's a right. snitch. Because guess what? Right. You don't all bloody talk to fucking snitches, eh? Right. Bro, fucking hell, man. This is why I say real reckon. No, I weren't going to say a word, you know? I weren't going to say a word, yeah? Because I know this is a real nigga, fam, and his view is as valid as my view. But you know what? You have to back him on that, fam. I have to back him on that, fam. Yeah, okay? If a man went... Listen. It's the road, fam. Fucked up rules and regulations, mate. Yeah? Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to give you an example, just like Conan's one. Something happened, yeah? He went jail. I mean, the, if something happened, he had to go court and testify. Or did he... Okay, now he might have got whirl of flack. He might have got whirl of shit. Whirl of that. But that's the road, fam. The road doesn't... You don't know how the road is going to be. You just sign up to it. And you know the rules of it. And if that means, yeah, bro, walking into a courthouse, yeah, you cannot do it. You can't do it. Now, I'm going to give you two examples. Okay, of when I've had to go against and get grief. And my mum look at me like, wow, you chose prison over my happiness. Yeah, I was 15 and the judge told me I can go home in five days or three years after doing nine months on remand for a street robbery. Okay, he said you've done nine months on remand, which is enough for anybody to, 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 to reconsider their actions. You have good family here. All you have to do is tell me who's with you. Okay, they, they, will, they will have no charges laid against them. None. We just want to see if your character's changed. My dad knew what it was, bruv. Anyway, I ended up doing free detained, didn't it? Right, another time when I met Grace. Yeah, her boyfriend phoned my phone on some threatening bad man thing. He wouldn't meet me as a man. Nowhere, people. Five hours. He picked the location. I stood there for five hours. He did not come, mate. Police had to run me three times from the corner, okay? And then they said they're going to arrest me if I don't go, all right? So I went home, okay? So when the policeman come to get Grace, yeah, to go court, yeah, for what the guy done. So remember, Grace is a nine to five, you know? Grace, I deal with only good girls, mate. Yeah, I don't deal with no fucked out chicks, mate. Tell me why I go and knock my fist. I deal with people that are from society. To, yeah, normal law-abiding chicks here yeah, to keep me grounded. Yeah, and keep me bilingual. And I can't run too far away from myself. Yeah, they keep me grounded. That's why I pick them types of chicks, mate. Yeah, I can pick money chicks and all that, bro. No, mate. Nah, not interested, bruv. I want a normal chick, bro. Yeah, cooks, cleans. Do you know what I mean? Does her thing, goes to work, loves her mum, loves people. Do you get me? Has good manners and can be relied upon and, and I know where to reach them when I need them. Simple as that. And ain't no game playing going on. Yeah? Okay? So I had to accompany her to court and they asked me if I want to say anything. I said, yes, I want to... Because that's my only chance to see him was to get in that dock. Yeah? You get me, fam? You got to come out. You understand where I'm coming from? And if you keep pushing it from behind bars or when he gets out anonymously, if I see him, yeah, that's it, innit? So that's my one chance to see the pussy. Yeah? That's the only time I've been in a courtroom, fam. All I said was yes. He made a text message. Yeah? Okay? He, he, no, he phoned my phone. Yeah, talking shit. That's all I said to them. Talking shit, mate. There was three women in there and me, bro. Yeah? Okay? And he still got not guilty anyway. Yeah? And that's why I don't blame women for not getting to courthouse. How the fuck does a man get not guilty? Do you know a girl that was there? Her auntie died at the time she was there. She chose to, to risk it. And her auntie died, yeah, while the girl was giving evidence. And he still got not guilty, bruv. He punched out her belly with a dumbbell when she was pregnant. How about that? Knocked out Grace four times in a bath in front of her niece. How about that? But let's go. My bad. Yeah? A snitch is a snitch. If you walk in that dock, yeah, okay? Right? Um, On something like that, yeah, okay? Me, I'm just backing up my missus, bro, yeah? And to be real, I want to catch the pussy, fam. Yeah, me beating him up, yeah? You know what's going to happen? I'm going to go to jail. So, so... I'm snitching on myself then, straight, but to me, I just need to see what a woman be I look like, fam, yeah, so if I see him, I can get him, fam, if I need to, straight, so forgive me for that, but that's my only motive, yeah, that and supporting my missus, yeah, okay, but on a murder charge, no, I wouldn't have been in there. Anyway, so, nigga, if you want to snitch, go ahead, do what you're doing, stay the fuck away from me. I don't right. want to know. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. But what I'm saying to you is, yeah, which they do anyway. I remember one thing, you know, people. Remember one thing, you know, people. I believe in what I'm saying in regards to, yeah, just using that to try and see what this brother looks like, right? Because you know what, yeah? I didn't have to tell you. And the very next thing he said was, a snitch is a snitch. So it's up to you how you want to deem that. 
I don't really care about that, bruv. Because I know one thing, mate. Yeah, I know what, I know what the brother looks like now, innit, fam, yeah? And if, if, if my missus said he was harassing her by phone or doing anything kinky, fam, okay, yeah? I know what he looks like now, innit, bruv? And the next image, you know what? Let me shut up here yeah, and give away the key evidence. No, yeah, I can get that brother anytime I fucking want, mate. Trust me, fam. Yeah, a couple of my friends know him. They got his number. It's not. It's like that. So you need to fall back, fam. Yeah, but I'm just saying. I told you because I don't tell lies, fam. Yeah, I couldn't finish what I was saying without telling you. Yes, I went to the court and yes, I said that brother there. Okay, phone my phone. Yeah, harassing me because I wanted to see what he looked like. They had him behind a screen for the women, so I couldn't see through the door. If I could see him through the door, I'd never gone in there. I told my missus that, but I want to see what he looks like. Yeah, she never had no photographs of him or nothing. I want to see what he looks like. Simple, he battered my missus, bro. All right? If you want to snitch, cool. But, yeah, what I'm saying to you is, yeah, if you want to snitch, well, not snitch, yeah, but we won't get, you ain't even further than that. You went into the dock and you said X, Y, Z, and then obviously now a man's doing an L play, da 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 but what I'm saying now is cool. That happened to you and your family, and obviously your mother right. said you done it for your right. mom and stuff like that. I was reading right. the newspaper article. Right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me say nothing as well. Right, yeah, I tried to get the brother family, just not weren't showing up, bruv. So there would have been no opportunity for me to snitch. Yeah, if I'd got him and whacked him up, fam, or vice versa. Yeah, okay. So please, yeah, this guy just went, didn't do no fancy stuff, no gunplay, no nothing. Went in the dock and snitched and got the brother, got the problem out of the way. I'm saying if you, yeah, you, yeah, are going to do that, what you need to do after that is be an advocate for gun crime. Right. Like, man should be seeing you on the marches with Mothers Against Violence right. and all that shit. You should be at the front. Right. Do you know the ones there? You should be campaigning with these people. Right. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't be Ross Clark jumping in videos. Right. He's talking about, they're saying shit with their chest. Yeah, you see what I'm saying, bro? See, if I say all these things, though, but you see, because Kozo's name is Certy on the roads, yeah, like certified, fam. No disrespect, he's younger than me, yeah? Okay, when his name was busting out, yeah, I was riding hardcore bang up, fam. I think me and him was doing bang at the same time when you got a six. You got a six, and I was in a high point. I heard that you got a six when I was in there. That no, kind of video should be. Is it a six? No, you got 14. 14 beneath you because you've really seen the effects of this gun crime and what it's done to the community in fact what it's done to your family right do you know what i mean so right. if your family and your management ain't telling you stuff like this bro you need to get new fucking management bro right do you know what i mean bro and like i said fam i'm not gonna sit here and say oh yeah you're this and you're that i'm not saying but i'm saying bro the least you can do after doing something like that by making a switch up like that is be an advocate for gun violence right not be in the videos. Look, the other, the other day, these man was in the video, got shot up because you want to stand around people right. that are in the that, 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 right. that association. Right, well. what did I say? What did I say the other day, bruv? This is word for word, bruv. Yeah? I said, fam, you should be upstairs looking down, bruv. What the fuck are you mingling with people for? Yeah? Bam. After that, now you're jumping in videos. Niggas are talking all this smack talk about, yeah, suck your mother, I said it with chest and da 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 da. Fuck, you know. Bro, you should, bro, you should just sing love songs. I heard you sing a good love song. You should just stick ah, to that. Ah, Do you get what I'm ah, saying? Ah, Before ah, I saw this thing the other day, that man showed me. You see, you see. I would have fucked with you guys for real. I would have, but I didn't. I didn't actually know that this is what was going on. Right. But now nah, I wouldn't even buy a ass club chicken wing from your shop. Right. That's 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 how really that's as fucking how real it is. Right. I wouldn't even buy a chicken wing. Right. I, I wouldn't even buy a ass club drink if I was first. These man got weight, fam. When a man is talking. Girl. These oh, man, that, see these man here, these man are OGs. But not as OG as me, as in like age and experience on the roads wise, yeah? Even though you probably seen a hell of a lot more than me, that's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about foot on concrete, yeah? Been on there from a long time before him, okay? Right? But then again, I can't say that. I don't know when he's been on road, but I, I, I'm a good few years old now, so I just make an assume, assumption. But as far as name brand's concerned, yeah, his name floats, all right? My name don't, fam. My name is just like, do you know him? Yeah, and if you know me, you know that I'm 30, bro. That's it, okay? I'm not, I wasn't out there to be a bad boy. I was out there to make Wong, okay? My crew weren't hard, yeah? Like that in the beginning. We, we grew to be hard. Furthermore, there ain't no one in my crew left apart from me. And my other brother is living in um, um, Liverpool. Yeah, okay? Right? And he's in trouble up there right now, yeah? But he's a big baller, isn't it, fam? Yeah, so he must know what he's doing. Yeah? But he's got fucking IRS after him, just what you call it over here. On his ras. Yeah, okay? They're trying to clap his yard, his cars, the lot, mate. I told him... I told him, fam, you don't want to listen. Do you get me, bro? But, 
My man's name on the screen, yeah? It's certain, yeah? When he talks like this, bro, no one can't tell him nothing to read, boy. They, they, the man is not on his level. They're not on his level at all. Yeah, the man they don't need no one, okay? Because they're the ones that people call, innit? Do you get me? You know, we're the ones that people call, innit? That's the fucking truth. You understand? But the red flag now, within Bounce's documentary, was when you sat there in that car and said, yeah, man, no, no. Yeah, we bust the Mac, me and Bouncer in the in the in the alley, and I had to hide it in my room and all that. Fam, allow it, bro, man. Come on, bro, man. You shouldn't be associating yourself with no kind of talk like that. Cause at the end of the day, nobody knows. Someone don't need to know. So what are you trying to do? Uh, trying part two. Um, and it's cut true, blood. It's cut true. Cut true like let's that. Let's go back. Let's go this. back. Let's go back here. Fam, allow it, bro, man. You know the ones there, bro. And that's the. Nah, I wouldn't even buy a rascal like chicken wing from your shop. That's 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 just how I really that's as fucking how real it is. I wouldn't even buy a chicken wing. I wouldn't even buy a rascal like drink if I was thirsty. You know what I'm saying, bro? And that's well, the fucking truth. Well, you understand? But the red flag now, within Bounce's documentary, was when you sat there in that car and said, "Idiot, yeah, man, no, no, yeah, we bust the Mac, me and that could fuck up your whole career, bro. Your whole." Career. Bouncer in the in the in the alley, and I had to hide it in my room and all that. Fam, allow it, bro, man. Come on, bro, man. You shouldn't be associating yourself with no kind of talk like that. Cause at the end of the day, nobody knows. Someone don't need to know. So what are you trying to do? Trying to make yourself look tough? Right. No, cause allow it, man. Don't don't do that, man. Don't do that, bro. Like I said, be an advocate for gun crime, and it's cut true, blood. It's right. Cut true. Right. Cut true like that. Forget all this. If it one minute man's in, one minute's out. Forget all of that, bro, man. Forget, death, forget, death. It, brothers. That's long, but you know what? I'm not gonna stay too long on you because that's all I want you to say. I'm not trying to ground you up. I'm just trying to tell you, bro. Love certain it. things you need to stay away from. It's like, all right, then, cool. This and this ain't no homo. This ain't no gay thing. Like, if you're if you've turned gay, I don't want to see you, my sister. Straight. You get it. Straight. Straight. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that I'm wrong. Straight. You being gay, because if you want to be gay, that's, that's your fine. business. Everyone has a right to be who they want to be. Right. Do you know what I'm saying? I'm not anti gay, I'm not anti anyone. No, he's like, to you, I used to be, be a, I used to be anti gay, bruv, but to do that now, you can go jail for it. So fuck it. Yeah, just live and let live in it. I don't want to see you, my sister. I'm going to have a problem. Do you get it? So that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, you just stick stick in your lane. You created that old lane for yourself. Now you can be that number one guy that's from the hood, that's been through certain things, seen certain things, has affected your family, and now I'm an advocate against gun crime. Don't be coming in and coming out. Forget all of that. That's dead. Yeah? Boom. Going on to the documentary now. Like I said, I was not going to say one word about that documentary. Not one word. Because to me, it's just a PR stunt. This is a blatant PR stunt. Do you know what I mean? The realest nigger in that Blood Clark documentary was Ross Clark Stormzy, to tell you the truth. Do you know the ones there? When I see a dog, you ain't talking hard. I shall know God. Be a squad. When the guns are numb, tell me toes and all. Screw and fuck the love. Then I'm gone. 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 Just to see the pain Lost the plot, I never lose a game Couple ups, I'm like, who again? Whoever wanted, nigga, choose a name They don't know the heart, I couldn't tell you Even if I wanted to, they'll lock me up Fuck me in the field, you know what's up Fuck me in the field, I'll fuck you up You know what I'm saying, brother? I don't know about the bounce that you men are trying to create in that documentary So like, and I'm going to connect this all Don't worry, I'm going to connect it all This is not all random things that I'm putting out there Making it sound like, oh yeah, I'm going at him, I'm going at him Yeah? So, like I said To me, that is not that is that 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 to me there is not no is not the guy that you're trying to claim that was in the documentary. You understand? Like I went like niggas are in the print talking about oh yeah when I went to school yeah my man he was in the year older than me. Bro, niggas in the years older than me yeah they look realer they look realer than life when I was small. Right. But now they're nobody. Nothing. Nobody. The fuck it. Bro, the top I. Nobody doesn't matter. The so-called hardest guy in my school he lives downstairs from me now, mate. Yeah, the so-called hardest guy in my school lives directly below from me, mate. He stole my wardrobe, mate. You know the story. 
Yeah? You know the story, but at school I wouldn't have told him nothing. Not a bloody bar. Not one word. Life changes, bro. Okay? Man ain't seen that on Rude Boy. Anything they've seen here is other people doing it, fam. Yeah? Straight like that, Rude Boy. Man's cowards, mate. If he's big in school, yeah, it looked like that when he's in school, but it doesn't mean you're a G. So I'm saying, niggas can be Gs in their little community or in their in you little, little group, in your little minds. Do you get what I'm saying? Right. Man? Yeah? Right. I'm not even going to go in any further into what right. I could say, because I'm not really trying to make it look like that. I'm just telling man what I've Straight. seen. Do you get what I'm saying, bro? Yeah? Straight. So now, we're going to go into the next part, because I was going to say something else, but it's not my business to say it. Yeah, my brethren told my, my brethren told my brethren something that my bouncer done. That showed me that 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 showed me a big weakness, but that's not my that's not my place to say it. Just the same way how Clue should not have sent that voice note to anybody. Right, thank you, thank and you. And saying, oh yeah, I'll take that on my chin. Thank you, no, no, bro. Thank you. Send that to nobody. Bow, that's bow, you bow, bow, bow. You know what I'm saying, man? Right. Just like what I'm doing now, I could say something here. Yeah, right. Just make man look so small. Right. But my bridge, somebody told my bridge in this, and it's facts. But I'm not gonna speak about it. It's not my place to speak about it. Do you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> put that one under the carpet. Uh, 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 fuck yeah. it. I ain't heard nobody else say these things. No one else but me. But Bionic, bro. Yeah, okay. Yeah, but me, fam. Yeah, okay. Straight. I haven't heard nobody else say these things. Okay. Real talk. Let's go. Put that one under the carpet. Yeah. Okay. Boom. Now, we're going to talk about what happened to Crept the other day. Okay, so you and I have gone to Birmingham, yeah? I'm hearing conflicting stories, but I'm just going to kill the conflicting stories, fuck it, yeah? Boom, because I don't really care what happened, yeah? But I'm just going to show you how everything's connected, yeah? Boom. You lot go to Birmingham, jeweled up, yeah? Why do you think you can go to Birmingham jeweled up? What? You know, you know, sir, let me just say something. No disrespect, right? This brother, he's well known out here, right? People know it's automatic beef, yeah? If you don't like something and you're pushing it, all right? They know that of him, okay? It's the same way with me. But you see what it is with me? My name don't ring bells like that, yeah? Because I've done too much bird at the wrong times, okay? So i got to be a bit more careful with how I speak, fam. But I will speak just like this guy and feel no way, fam. I just don't... Feel the need to, bruv. You don't know my steezo, yeah? Do you get me, fam? Like, you know, I had to show you a couple things, bruv, in the beginning that I didn't want to show you, blood, yeah? But, man ain't no fucking... You get me, fam? Man ain't no sit down and just take it, nigga, bruv, okay? But at the same time, you can't win... You can't fight and win every war, neither, okay? Or maybe you can win every war if you pick the right ones, yeah? Okay? Simple. But I'm just not in the free arguing, yeah? And I realise... Calling man's name on the internet, it's just free arguing. They ain't even no anti, they, they ain't even no climax. It's just a bag of talk. And then before you know it, yeah, rude boy, yeah, you feel like you've got a problem on the road when there ain't really one there, fam. Come on, them stunting. Do you get me, bro? I'm not, you get me? Yeah, I'm just doing my channel the way that I see fit, bro. But I'm happy that there's another nigga on the internet, yeah, who's prepared to speak his mind too, bro. Yeah, and he can do, he can do it with a lot more authority than me because them man there, people know their, their caliber, innit? Me, I've got to show people my caliber. That's what the difference is. Bro, you got to recognize, bro. Listen, you see in your in your community, you're in your little, your little group or... Bro, it doesn't mean because you man think he's a gangster, they're gangsters in the whole vicinity. Right. Do you get what I'm saying, bro? Right. Like, there's certain places, unless you're rolling with the real man them, yeah, you can't go. When I go Manny, I roll with the real man them. When I go Brum, I roll with the real man them. If I'm going to Sheffield, I'm rolling with the real man them. And you know why I'm rolling with the real man them? Because real recognise real. Right. Do you understand what I'm saying, bro? Right. So, there's no way I'm going anywhere. I don't give a shit. I could be the baddest man in my area. I'm not going to, out of town, jewel that like I run the place. Right. I've seen niggas do that before and lose their jewelry, bro. Right. Do you understand, fam? A man could have just been on the corner with man, patterned up. But man wants to play this little showboat thing like they around the place. And niggas lose their jewelry. Right. This is what happens, bro. So, what I'm saying to you is, yeah, bruv, unless you're rolling with the real man them, yeah, or your man them is associated with the real man them, don't go nowhere, bro. Don't, don't, don't go nowhere jeweled up like you run the place. A man's talking about, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, Mitch, Mitch, mistaken, I did, Mitch, bro, listen. 
Man knows who you are, innit? Man ain't gonna mistake you for Mitch. Mitch you got what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's all bullshit. I mean, so much conflicting stories is bullshit. You understand? But like I said, this is where it's all connected. If man moves properly and does what they need to do properly as a community, those things don't happen. Right. Everyone wants to be in their own little corner and don't show man that, that, yeah, I'm on stuff and rare, rare, right. rare. If you're just patting up with the real G. Right, don't want to share nothing. I've been saying this, bruv, yeah? you got to share, fam. I live in a hostel with 16 men, okay? None of them are probably active on the road, yeah, bro? Everything's belly to these men there, fam. They don't know me, I don't know them, but we learn to know each other because we live in the same building, bruv, yeah? But I'm out there, I'm not saying they're not. I don't know what they do, but they know what I do because they see it. Motorbike changing all the time. Do you get me, fam? One day, man's in and out, in and out, in and out. Got new this, new that, new... But they know what's going on, fam. So you know what I have to do, yeah? Is go and bless, man. Say, yo, God, what's going on, fam? You're good, bruv. Chat to man for a little bit, bruv. No disrespect or nothing, fam. How you living? Yeah, boom, hold that rude boy. Come on, fam. Man's all the G in it, fam, for them. Yeah, they can't they can't tell you I didn't do that, bro. Knock man's door, give man a hundred pounds. Yeah, two hundred pounds. Yeah, give man free food. But I gave a man two Zs of food. Two two Zs of raw. No, I give him a Z of raw. Okay, bruv. Yeah, which went for fifty hundred quid at the time. It was straight flake. Okay, bro. Yeah, okay. I didn't even know him that well, fam. I didn't even know him that well. Yeah, but because he did food, I thought, right, the most logical thing to do, I had bare pellets. Bare. Okay? 12.5 gram pellets, like enough of them. Not even, no, not 12.5 gram, my bad. 14, 12.5 gram pellets. A bear of them, bear of them, bear of them, bear of them. Yeah? Straight oil, touch it, boom, liquid, bruv. Yeah? Do you get me? Rather than give the man money, yeah, I said, bruv, you're lying. Yeah? You never got more than an eight ball on it, right? Yeah? Okay? Here you go, fam. It's a Z of four. Man took it and shot it and took his girlfriend shopping. That was a joke. You took the thing, shot it one time, yeah, and spent the money off, and then tried to come and take eight balls from me, fam. I was so disgusted. Them, this shit don't happen. Do you understand? This shit don't happen, bro. And it's either that or pay for some real security, bro. Right. Because man is not what they're saying they are, bro. Right. Or what they're portraying they are. It's all right being in the video and you know what it is. Suck their mother with chest. Do you know? Do you, you know what it is, bro? It's it's like car insurance. The reason why, yeah, they screw. Yeah, when you actually make a claim, it's because the likelihood of someone having an accident every five seconds is not it's not a lot, is it? So it's like they're getting money for nothing. Yeah, okay? And your guys rolling with you know that well half the time nothing ain't gonna happen, yeah. So it's free money. And I'm not with you all the time. So anytime I want the money, yeah, I can just roll with you and get paid for a little security, bro. But they ain't doing that and they're loose balling, they're scared just like you. They ain't bringing no beef. You need to get man that's been in beef that activate straight away. They don't just stand up and pose, they clamp man. But what are you doing, cuz? Yeah, no, 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 sorry, we, I'm security, boom, what are you doing, fam? Don't take it personal, but you're moving too close to man, fam. Strong man up, rude boy, or brick wall it in front of a man, fam. Yeah, but know that a man can stab you, but you signed up for it, bro. You signed up for it, bro. But when a man sees you, you better be on that smoke, you better have that same energy, bro. You know the ones there, bro, you better be on that same energy, because shout out the Express True Show, uh, bro, they said something that I, that I agreed with. Ed Sheeran could go out, and a man won't trouble him. Because of the energy they put out. But if you're in your video talking about you're saying it with chest, suck your money with chest, bro, man's gonna test your gangster, bro. Right. But if a man in their mind's thinking, oh, I'm rolling with this man and that man, so man can't touch me, man's gonna make a big mistake, bro. Right. I'm telling you, bro. So what man needs to do, yeah, is stop all this little segregated thing and pattern up, bro. But I've been saying this. Pattern up. I've been saying These it. Things don't happen, I've been bro. saying it. Things don't happen. But you see niggas go, but in America, niggas travel from state to state with a million pound worth of jewelry. Because everything's patterned up. Like, man, don't get it twisted, fam. Like, it's not, it's not, it's, man's, man's not, man's not as real as they think, bro. Right. You know what I'm because they're standing in videos making up right. videos, bro. Man's got a little jewelry and they're thinking they're real. So this don't, don't work like that, bro. You understand? So, yeah, it's not good what happened, but you got to live in the reality, bro, of what's happening. And if man not live in the reality of happening, these little things will happen and these right. things will catch up on man, bro. Right. You that's it, bro. That, that is, that's, that's my story for today, bro. And you put it all up, think about it. Man's rolling around with man who man don't rip. What do you think? See, what, do you, what do you think's gonna happen out there, bro? Right. Things are gonna happen. Things are gonna happen. So you need to pattern up and roll with the man them that man them rates. Stop trying to have a little section over here and no one will deal with the realest guys and come on bro man, you need to man, bro, you know how attractive do you know how do you know how attractive jewelry is to a broke nigga fam? Yeah? Right, it is as good as money. Furthermore, people like going pawn shop. They like the surprise of what they get. Especially when it's free. Yeah? Oh, yeah, we're giving out £14 a gram. 2-2. Two, two. This is back in the day. 
So, okay, 14 pound. I go, hold on a minute. How many grams is it? Yeah, 200 grams. 200 grams. Bum bakla, I'm good, fam. What the fuck are you talking about? Give me that loot, fam. Do you get me? 15, 16, bro. Bursting, bursting two twos. No, my bad. 15, bursting two twos. Yeah, then coming out. No, and 19. Yeah, no, I actually lie. I was bursting two twos and I was 19, fam. Yeah, bursting them. Monstering two twos and two fours. But yeah. Anywhere. Because I'm going to be patting up with the realest man them in every state, bro. Simple. Man don't understand them rules. Forget it, bro. Forget it. A man can't have a little link with a little one man that's that's shot in a little food or got a one line in the area and talking about he runs the place. Fuck them niggas. Them niggas are just coming up. You need to pattern with the man that don't even look like that that look like he just looks low key. Cause them man there that's really running the place. Cause right now them man there's high them man there's not hiding, but they don't want to be seen. But once you pattern up with them man there, everything's patterned. Do you understand? So yeah. It's Quincy to Cozzo. I just need to get that off my chest for real. You understand? It is what it is. Like I said, I'm not even trying to throw no shade, man. I'm just speaking the reality of the situation, bro. You understand? I could have said a lot worse. Right. I could have jumped on the bandwagon that everyone's jumping on, but I don't think like niggas. Huh? I have my own way of thinking. Yeah? Simple. So, yeah, this is Quincy to Cozzo. Yeah. And, um, yeah. Oh, yeah, as well. I just want to say my condolences to the Bradish brothers. Yeah, I done a long bird with them. And obviously, as I see on Scar City Studios, their son died. Obviously, I ain't seen them for years, but yeah. Sorry to hear about your loss, my brother. And you know, I hope you lot are doing all right. You get me? But yeah. Peace out. That was me. This brother, right? Fessa 5. How old do you think he is, bro? He's talking through braces, yeah? Or he's got a bad mouth full of water, bro, yeah? Right? I got a little list myself, bro, but he's got a bad one. It sounds like he's drowning in his mouth. Yeah? Now, my thing is this, bro. Who the fuck is he that he thinks he can give an opinion on this? Here's my opinion on it. Like, have you even been anywhere near anything named beef, bro? I'm not talking about Sainsbury's meat rack food, boy. Yeah? I'm talking about, have you ever been scared in your fucking life, pussy? Yeah? See, but good anyway. I'm good. I'm glad. I'm glad you did this video. Because now, the so-called chosen ones... Okay, bruv, because he's all right. I ain't got to worry about him. Now the so-called chosen ones, yeah, have to make a decision now. Yeah? Okay? And the decisions are only going to be made from the fact that it's them. And I'm saying they could have easily, like, people like this prick that's about to talk, yeah? Okay? You could have made it so that, bruv, that's, bruv, what these guys do, fam, beat them up, fam. Yeah? Shut them down. Yeah? Right? They're talking about, man, they're digging up people's lifestyles, bro. Laughing at people, making videos of sheer misery, fam. This geezer's got videos called Rappers Who Got Run Up On, Part 1, 2, 3, and 4. Give me some, where's Nines? Where's Nines, man? Nines got stabbed in his face. That would be a good, he ain't said nothing since he got stabbed in his face, man. Uh, where's Nines, bro? Him and K-Cot would have been a good beef, don't you think? What do you think? Leave it in the comments. Yeah? Ah, uh, where are they gone? Do you get me, like, like, he wants the drama. Yeah, the guy wants the drama. They've obviously heard me talk, yeah, and then he chopped that out of his video, okay, and put up another one and tried to fucking confuse you, mate. This geezer wants the drama. He would speak a hell of a lot worse, bro, but he knows man sticking it on him from afar, bro, and I'm making valid points, fam. Yeah, fucking reveling in, in people's misery, bro. Yeah, you ain't got no method to your style. Yeah, all it is is put it up there. Put it up there, yeah, and get the numbers. There is no method. There is no, there is no mentoring. There is no raw, good or bad. Yeah, you're just putting it up there, yeah, to be famous because you can't do it nowhere else, you little know, idiot. You're going to listen to someone your mouth, fam. Ain't no one listen to you. Listen to the little pussy sounds, fam. Yeah, call him pussy, suck his mother and a cunt. Yeah, because I don't know who he is. So how can I offend him? He could knock my door right now and I wouldn't know it's him. So, bro, don't take it personal, mate. Yeah, you don't expect anybody else to take it personal, do you? When you're fucking putting up their business. Making videos over the weekend, I was ill, so I didn't really get a chance to cover what happened with Crept. Other channels did, but I just want to give my thoughts on what happened. So one extra, I'll come under some stick. You're meant to protect these artists. How do you do that? Have more security in place, but stuff like this still goes down. Even in big nightclubs and stuff like that. When you let me tell you something. That, if there's big you know the reason groups, why? The reason why I don't ever want to be the first. Bob, I live in the fucking ends, man. Yeah, I get phone calls all the time about who done what from what not. On point, in the hour. Yeah, okay? But I don't talk about them straight away because I don't have no knowledge. Okay, bruv? So this guy talking right now, don't make him fool you, you know? Yeah? Like he's he's this guy and, bro, they should have had uh, protection. And, he don't care about none of that. He has just listened. Like he said, he was ill. So he just listened to the general consensus of what's going on. Normally, he'd be the first one out there to run up his mouth, talk about, bro, look, this happened. Just for the wow factor. Yeah? You can't cast an opinion so quick. 
But these guys do that. And then they come back on a part two and say, well, you know, they listen to everybody else. They don't want to stand alone. Because these little pussies never stand alone. These little wankers can never stand behind their own words. They have no conviction at all. None. And they ain't been convicted. Yeah, neither. Yeah, to be able to talk, qualify themselves in even the slightest way to talk about this shit. Get me fucking little nondescripts, read by it. They still can be brawls and stuff that happens. Now, this falls down to Bruce. why. If anyone Did you hear what in he said? the industry has kind of left it. Did you hear what he said? Who uses this word to describe fighting? Yeah? Or drama? Who uses the word bulls? We're not in a fucking courthouse. Now, this falls down to why. If anyone in the industry has wait, kind of wait. left it, they still can be brawls and stuff that happens. Bulls. Now, this falls down to why. If anyone in the industry has kind of left the streets the best, that's Crept and Conat. But if you go back to Tupac, he had a quote saying that, I've tried. Tupac and Crept. Fucking hell, what about me, bro? And other people like me, fam. We left the road too, fam. Yeah, and they have not left the road the best. How can left the road the best, Reba, when they're still getting caught up in fuckery? Yeah. I have to leave it, but you can't. Like, he's saying you can't. And um, from now, our generation, there's always going to be videos online of you talking crud. And even Crept and Conan still do, even though they've got their own restaurant and their own businesses and left, they still rap street. And yeah, they come from that. And, you know, he's back, he's in Gypsy back in the day and stuff like that. But when you still talk that, and you're even like their newest song, stuff Look. like they're still talking like that, Look. you're still kind of in that realm. What's this? And Hold on, wait, people. wait, wait. The knife, they made it yesterday. So we listen to it. I can hear a lot of people's words in his mouth. Yeah? I can hear a lot of people's words in his mouth, fam. This spread is like a fucking tape recorder, blood. You know what I call it? Collection of thoughts, blood. You know when people go in one room, fam, a man's talking to them consciously, using words, and it sounds good, fam. And they, and they just record it in their head. Yeah? They, 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 they hear it, but they don't understand what they're talking about. And then they go next door where that guy ain't. And then they instigate that conversation just so they can say that. Because they think it make them sound official, blood. This is these little pussy holes right here, bro. The dickhead niggas, bro. We'll see you. Allegedly, the guy that did it... Did, was did, you, hear did you hear the amount of spit in his mouth? Did you hear about... Did you hear the amount of spit in his mouth? Allegedly, the little kid. That. Listen. And you're even like their newest song stuff like that, they're still talking like that. You're still kind of in listen, that Listen, listen. And other people will see you. Allegedly, the guy... Fucking hell, what did he say? People will see you. Allegedly, the guy that did it wasn't the... And other people will see you. Allegedly, the guy do you. Allegedly, the guy do you. Allegedly, the guy that do you. Allegedly, the guy that. Right, that's you know why I'm doing that. It's a little kid, bruv. It's a little boy. Come out of prison not long ago and was meant to be started. Uh, just got into rap or something like that. So, you know, they're gonna look at you and be like, "Are oh, you that guy?" And they're gonna want to test you. Even are you that, that guy? Really are you that guy in any way at all? That guy, bruv. You are you, fam. You know what? Let me just run off. Right, no. Actually, fuck that. The whole point of this video wasn't about this idiot. My bad people. I get carried away with fucking idiots, mate. My video, bruv, is because, you see, if you would help me, uh, you know, at least keep fucking the dirt to the dirt, bruv, on it, right? You wouldn't be spoken about in this way. People wouldn't, it would be a general rule, like you don't talk about people after, after maths. Do you get me, fam? Unless it's your haters, rude boy. Yeah, everyone else is shut up here and have respect, fam. Yeah? Okay, a man got hurt, rude boy. When he resurfaces, when he resurfaces, bruv. Because you don't resurface in a certain amount of time. He's moist. Did you go through it, blood? Now he's got stabbed in his face, rude boy. Do you know how violent that is? Do you know if they actually not if they actually stabbed him and not cut him, if they stabbed him in his face, where's that blade going, fam? It's banging on bone, you know. Or it's going through his mouth. Or in his eye. Or on the side of the bruv. Either way, it's a very, very violent act. The person that did that is capable of a lot more. Alright? To stab someone in their face is a very serious thing to do, bruv. Yeah? It's harder to, it's easier to shoot people, blood. That act there is very hard to yap a man and stab him in his face, blood. And then walk around like, bruv, you're, you're, like, you're fearless, like no one can't do you nothing. That's a bad man, bro. That's a bad man, bro. Yeah? Okay? Because if a man's in his car, yeah, only one man can get in there and do that. He might be surrounded, fam. But only one man can actually go in there and do that to him, fam. That's a bad man, bro. It's hard, yeah. Yeah, but now look, you lot are now on ID parade, yeah? For everyone to talk about you moist blood, they're talking about you snitching, man's on the stand, yeah? They're talking about you lot are loose balling, you've got no sense, you're stupid. All of these things have been said about all of you on here. Yeah, your friend, Clue, yeah, people are blowing him up now saying, nah, bro, how the fuck that get up there, fam? Do you get me? But you see, because you lot are fickle and stupid and you just lap up these guys' shit, they think they can just come on the screen and get away with it. 
Okay, with things like that. Nah, bro, they've rewritten the whole game plan, fam. Yeah, no, bro. No, fam. How does a fucking a voice go up on the internet, man? Yeah? And, and, and at the same time, you've left it up there. Yeah, it was up there. Now everyone's got it, fam. Yeah, okay? Cool. Man, and he wasn't, he wasn't snitching. That video don't show nothing. That video don't show nothing. But you, that, the guy can't be trusted, fam. Crept ain't doing no wrong on that video, fam. What the fuck you think people are made of? Fucking iron steel gold blood. Yeah? Like, you just been yapped. Of course he's gonna talk about it, fam, to anyone that asks him that's a friend. Of course he is, blood. Bruv, that's how I know certain men ain't been through that and read, but you see when you go through a problem that's a bit above yourself at that moment, fam. Not later, and not before, but at that moment, it's above you, fam. Bruv, you're hollow man off, blood. You don't wanna talk to no gal. You get strength from man in them situations. I don't, I ain't got no friends like that right now, okay? Right? But it'll be nice to have one, and if I did have one, yeah, of course I'm gonna be sad of him, bruv. I just got yapped. Fuck, man. Yeah? But, to be spoken about in this way at all is not what you want. It's not what you want, and you could have easily avoided it by either putting your hand in your pocket and getting the right amount of security and entourage. You mean to say you and your friend couldn't put together some money? But you'll splash that, though. But you'll splash that, fam. Do you get me, bro? This is what I'm saying. Anyway, all these things need to happen, yeah? For the future. Yeah, okay? So people can move better, fam. Because this is a joke, bro. Now more people are going to protect their fucking jewelry, mate. Trust me. But go on, little man. Still in that situation, do you know what I'm saying? They know who they were stabbing. They didn't think crap was someone else. They just, they was going for him, do you know what I'm saying? So it comes down to the thing that, can you ever fully leave the roads? That's the thing. You can set up your own restaurants, no matter how much money you get. Can you ever leave that predicament completely? Um, it always can come back to haunt you at any point. That's what these little youngers don't understand nowadays. You put them rap videos online, talking crud. Um, Hold on. Crept and Conan do actually come so from, then, he, he must be to, to He must be old enough for then. I take that back. He said he's little youngsters, right? But then again, I've heard, I've heard 15 year olds called, called 11 and 13 year olds youngsters, bro. So I don't know what that means no more, bro. But this guy can't be no more than 21 then. He can't. From what I know, there was in Jip set back in the day and a few gangs here and there and done their thing. But obviously, they've, they've left that now. So if these youngsters, they, they want to post videos online talking all the blah, blah, blah. And then later on, they want to live a separate life, you know, just go casual, go working. I remember... Um, a rapper said about I can't work in JD because people will attack me. That's because you've spoken stuff online and talked about blah blah blah, and they're gonna want to test that. So yeah, it begs the question: Can you ever fully leave this? You, I don't think it you begs can. The question. There's always someone with a point to prove. It and begs the question, people. It begs the question. When you talk a certain way, like Dave, let's look at Dave. Dave would have a cheeky bar here and there about talking road, blah, blah. But I don't think people would ever target him like on some road stuff. He's just not looked at as a road rapper. Crept Conan, I've, like, last couple of years, I don't really look at him like that either. Do you know what I mean? More storytellers a bit, like, but they've had road songs, like proper road out songs talking in crowd, so people will still try them no matter what they do. So yeah, I, I want you guys to come like, can you ever fully leave this or can it come back to haunt you at any point when you've got online videos talking about you do this and that and you would blah, blah, blah. It always can come back to haunt you. There's always that guy with a point to prove. Bro, you, might be talking, be that guy you might be talking up. to some, <laughs> new, some new YouTubers, mate. You might be talking to some new members, bro. This is an age-old argument, bro. Okay? Can you leave, bro? I can tell you the, the, the answer to that. No, you cannot, fam. People don't want you. The, the, people don't know how to leave you alone. If you walk and keep your head straight, eventually someone's going to do something or get in your way or just want to fuck with you, bruv. When, you don't know, but it will happen. I'm in the car with my missus, bro. yeah, going to the post office, bruv. People tried to stab me out there with a samurai sword or whatever that fucking thing was, yeah? Okay, in front of my missus, while everybody watched in between Patty King and the post office. No one gave a shit. We are so desensitized and scared, okay? Because these people stab bystanders now. Anyone touch them, you're getting wet, stabbed, acid thrown on you. That's how they're moving, blood. They don't care, fam. So playing hero is the next thing. Yeah? To so no, you can't. Or just jealous, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't just necessarily mean because it's road stuff. They could just be jealous of crap, you know, look how much money they got. And they, have, they don't have a hard time flashing it. I remember seeing, you know, 50s all over crap's bed, him posing, he's got a nice girl. People could just be jealous too. Oh, but, I, remember um, having, I remember having 50s over my bed from road. Don't mean nothing. Stop judging things like that as a big deal, blood. Yeah? When you put that into one object, yeah, what's it really bought? Do you know what I'm saying? You know? 
you know, I want these guys to comment below. What's your thoughts on this? Let's get a conversation going. Once you talk that crowd online, can you ever really escape it? Or people always go look for your stuff and always going to see that and want to test you. Um, I'm so glad he's okay. I'm a huge fan of Crep. I'm not coming at him. I'm just getting a conversation going about why this could have happened. And um, yeah, man, always people have a point to prove. Shouts out to Crep. He's meant to be coming back soon, dropping saying So I'm so glad he's okay. And um, hope to see new music from him soon. Uh, subscribe to the channel, like this video, and comment below what your thoughts are on what happened and why this sort of stuff happens now. Like, you know, it's petty. It's so petty, really. It's not worth it. Um, someone could lose their life. A really talented person could have lost their life. And over what? Do you know what, bruv? It's glad, I'm glad to hear you talking the way you're talking. Eventually, bruv. I'll say that as a final thought for you, blood. I'm glad to hear that, mate. Yeah? Because now you realise, sometimes you need a tongue lashing in her. Yeah, okay, and I'm not the only person I think that does it on the internet, mate. Yeah, I don't know, I don't do it or target anyone, fam. I just think it's like cheeky or audacity, fam. Yeah, it's like when people keep phoning me, saying to me, oh, bruv, or messaging me, raw, oh, this one's saying that about you on the internet. I keep telling you people, yeah, the internet don't have no real drag in my real life, mate. Okay, I, I rely on the fact that, bruv, that's that, that place, yeah, and this is my life, yeah, okay, right? When I go there, I find out all of that, bro. And the battle is only for the channel. Like, raw, you bad up my channel. You didn't bad me up, bro. You bad up my channel then. Cool. But you didn't bad me up, fam. Yeah? Internet is internet. It's channel versus channel. It's not man versus man. Because it's man versus man, yeah, bro. Then let me get my hands on you then, innit? Do you know what I mean? Or at least come and give me a weight ch challenge. Do something that proves you're better than me then, bro. But until then, yeah, it's just channel versus channel to me, mate. Yeah? So people need to stop telling me what people are saying. <coughs> In my real life, if you want to tell me on the internet and all of that, you risk getting blocked, mate. Real talk, yeah? Real talk. That's one of my rules, mate. Don't tell me about what other people are talking about. Come and distract me from what I'm talking about. Or put some idiot thoughts in my head when I'm chilly most. People, I'm out of here.